conversation. You are taking, bringing people from all over the world and letting them show their family. You are supporting and nurturing them for this. We will, all of us, thank you very much. Woo! Now, since it is the music here in the world, I thought what I'd do is talk to you about the future, creating your future. So, uh, from the heart, please, that one of the greatest assets for raising money for filmmakers and artists is your mind. That your mind is your greatest asset. And so much so that we read books. And in our film funding class, we all know how to pitch and things like that. So what do we do? We study the mind and how to use the mind to have a happy little life and to make the film or create your art. So we read books like The Field with Lynn McTaggart. She taught us that physicists say that we are very powerful beings. We have a lot of things that we can do. It's only us that comes and hold ourselves back. And we studied um, the conscious universe. That's Dr. Dean Brayden. He's another physicist and he says all of us have uh, ESD or the ability, we have an innate ability to tell us what's right and wrong. Uh, so you may call that your gut feeling, whatever it is, he said, use it. And the best book we found was uh, Think and Grow Rich. Now, if you remember the steel magnet, Andrew Carnegie and his money is still here today funding films and other venues like this. Carnegie hired a gentleman called Napoleon Hill and said, I want you to take uh, a trip and go interview all of the people who are wealthy. I want you to do the top 100 wealthiest men and come back to me and tell me what is their secret, what do they do, how do they become wealthy. So Napoleon did just that. And when you read the book, you'll find that he says the first thing you have to have is a burning desire. Well, think about it. I've never met a filmmaker or an artist that didn't have a burning desire. So with that, you're 50% to where you want to be. If you want to raise money or make your art, you're 50% there. So what's next? Goal setting. Wealthy people set goals. So I recommend that you consider an easy goal, something short, concise, that you know you can do and give yourself a time limit. So you have the desire, you have the goal, and what's next? Focus. Total focus is required to get what you want. And so, time is an element. You need to put time into your art. 15 hours a week is a minimum. And you can find that time. You have to give up a little Netflix, but you can find it. <laughs> then, what's next? Care of time it has more things that are available for you. Dr. Fred Adam Wolf is the creator of 18 books. He's a highly creative guy, and he had some articles about time travel. So I interviewed him and said, tell us about creativity. We all want to know where is it we go and how to get there. And he said, well, Carol, it's time travel, and here's how it works. Think of Louis B. Carroll and Alice in Wonderland and go to the scene where the Red Queen says to Alice, do you remember what you did yesterday? What you're doing tomorrow? Do you, did you remember what you're doing tomorrow? And Alice says, I can't do that because tomorrow isn't here. And the Queen said, what a poor memory that only goes one way. That is very sad. <laughs> so Dr. Wolf, what does this mean? And he says, where do you think you go? What are you doing when you have a story and you decide, okay, I'm going to have this actor in this story, and I've got this makeup in mind, that hair, that costume, that location. Where are you? I said, well, I'm thinking of it in my head. And he said, no, you're in the future. This is time travel. Physics says so. Quantum physics says it. Okay, so how do we use that? And he said, you, when you are daydreaming, is another way to use your mind. Because he said that a handshake across time happens when you are 
seeing your film, in a screening room, and it's a standing ovation, or when you're getting an award, these things you created in your mind. And I honestly think, I've been telling my filmmakers to say, I am an award-winning filmmaker for so long, and I have an award, so it works. I'm really <laughs> Thank you.